it comes once a week, you gotta play today. You gotta play your ass off. Raise a little hell, Johnny. Here we go. I'm anxious to see your play selection here. Okay, you got Yeah. Hey, play faster! Play faster! Play faster! Crush the passer! Come on! How stupid are we? Hey! That's it! That's all side! Is the smoke wide open? Where is Galloway? No, still still inside. inside. Still night. inside. I gotta get some wide outs! Find out where he is, Cedric! Go get his ass out here! Are you alright? I got cramp. Let's play! You got more left? Yeah, let's go! You're killing me! Offensive coordinator, John Gruden, but folks, they will in fact demand significant compensation. Now, teams that have expressed interest are the Cowboys. What's that smell? I smell smoke. And what kind of smoke would that be? Well, my smoke that I smell is not uh, not of the illegal variety, uh, but of the um, variety that Jerry Jones is starting to become a little bit known for. Um, let's see, first we fire our special teams coach who needed to be fired, no doubt about it. Uh, then we decide uh, yesterday, uh, not too far after the news of Gruden, uh, surprise, surprise, just like Shanahan being fired, um, that he's going to be, that he's gone. And then there, the news comes out that Garrett is very, very close to landing with St. Louis. Hmm. So all three of the major coordinators gone, but the head coach is still there. Doesn't make sense to me. And so this special comment is on uh, the imminent, and I'm saying it right now, imminent uh, coaching change that we will be having. I'm convinced it's going to happen. Um, I don't think for a second that Jerry's going to go into the new stadium, state of the art, with a uh, state of the team under in disarray with Wade Phillips. So right now, I'm saying flat out, we are getting a new coach, period. Um, so who is that going to be? Could it be Holmgren a year early? Probably not. So it comes down to really two guys, uh, Shanahan, Gruden. Both have strengths, both have weaknesses. I am a huge Gruden fan. Uh, reason being is I've, I've been in the Bay Area for the better part of the last eight years. I saw what he did in Oakland, and that offense was my favorite offense uh, since the old boys' offenses, and, and I love the Niners' offenses. And, you know, I know. It sucks to say that, and it's almost sacrilege, but the way to move down the field, um, especially with that Raiders offense, I mean, he had Garner and Wheatley, two-headed monster. Uh, he had Rice, he had Porter, he had Tim Brown all catching balls. Then they'd throw in a little bit of Roland Williams in there. Um, the offense was big. It was mauling. You know, he had uh, Lincoln Kennedy uh, and uh, Gogan anchor in that line. Um, he's not adverse. He's not going to be running that, that system that, that Shanahan likes, those big, limber um, linemen that, you know, do the illegal chop blocks and whatnot. So Gruden is a guy that I just love. He runs that West Coast offense. Um, his quarterbacks, he turned Gannon, Rich Gannon, into an NFL MVP. Uh, look what the numbers that Garcia's put up under him, Greasy's put up under him. Uh, the only guy that's been pretty unsuccessful, really, was um, was was um, Chris Sims. I mean, Chris Sims kind of didn't get it. Uh, I don't, you know, now the words are coming out that the players didn't like him and he should have been gone years ago. Malarkey. Crock of crap. Okay? Saying it right now. Uh, Bill Parcells asked Phil Sims what he felt about him when he was playing for him. He hated his guts. Hated him. You know, didn't like that Lord's Taylor would be treated uh, one way and he'd be treated another. But, you know what? These guys balled for him and they balled for Gruden and he is the right man for the job at the right time. The time is now. The man is Gruden. Jerry, you need to get this done. Done, done, done. You hear me? Okay, get it done. He's still young. He's under 40. I mean, 
this is this has got a long standing I mean it's perfect. Uh, I hate the ramble, but Gruden isn't gonna ask to for personnel decisions. He isn't gonna ask for free agents. He he's gonna just coach the team, come in at three in the morning, bust his ass, get the guys fired up, show some fire. It's you know, and he's not afraid to put up with crap. Keyshawn, he cut his he cut his ass. He traded him to, to us. You know, he he was like, enough of that. Um, you know, Garcia didn't quite put up the way, you know, he put up good numbers, but not the way he wanted it. Gone. You know, he's worked with Brad Johnson, so Brad Johnson knows him. He knows the offense. Um, so you have Brad Johnson on for another year uh, that knows the offense, that can help Romo. It makes total sense to bring Gruden in. And, as you can see with my intro here, uh, it hasn't been like we haven't been interested in him before. So keep an eye on this. I, I just it it seems too fishy that Stewart and Gruden's firings both came very close to each other, and then the news of Garrett. So it you know for one year Wade Phillips you know it, it sounds like they're trying to force his hand to either take the DC job and and bring in Gruden or or else. And he might even just do that, which would be a perfect scenario. Um, Gruden has no problems with success. If you have a successful, you know, he kept Monty Kiffin on, which was wise, and that's why they won the Super Bowl uh, against the Raiders. Um, you know, that combined with his knowledge of the Raiders scheme. But it's it makes so much sense to bring in Gruden. I know uh, he has his detractors out there, but we need a fiery, offensive oriented, quarterback oriented, ass kicking coach. That ain't gonna take any crap. And this is the guy. Bring him in, Jerry. That's all I gotta say. Um, I'm sure people are gonna look at this and, and laugh, but this is this is the guy for the job. Not Shanahan, not Holmgren, John freaking Gruden. I hope I can say I told you so in another couple weeks. I hope we can talk about a lot of more positive stuff in the next couple weeks uh, with, with, with a changing of the guard. I think it's going to happen. I smell the smoke. I see it. I'm calling it right now. Gruden is coming to Big D.